Hello and thank you very much for clicking on this video. Before I jump in into demonstrating how you can edit PDF file with your deck setup and your device if you have a stylus, I'd like to give you a quick history why I'm doing this and why I decided to do this. I'll demonstrate this for you. About two, three months ago, I was involved in the accident. Well, I wasn't in the accident. Uh, I was a witness of a car crash that happened in front of me. I was driving home from work and Basically, two cars crashed into each other. Not ma massive crash, just a small scratch either side, um, and basically a small dent on the door and etc. So I stopped, spoke to the uh, the person who's got hit, gave my details, and a couple hours later, I received the information via text message asking me for my email address and etc. And if I'm happy that they're gonna pass my details to the insurance company, I said fine, they can contact me. I'm happy to help just to make sure that all this process is done. And, and complete it as quick as possibly can because it was just before like going to the season where everybody's going and doing the bits for Christmas. So uh, next day I received a phone call from the insurance company. They asked me if I'm willing to fill the details inside the a document, a form. They're going to send me a form by email. I will fill the details and then am I, am I happy to do that? And I said, no problem. Send me this file. I'll fill the details. I'll send it back to you as soon as I can. So they sent me a PDF file. And as probably most of you, what you would do, you will print this form, you fill this form and scan it and send it back. Or my, what might happen, you print this form, you're filling this form and you made a mistake or misspelling or you marked the wrong answer or something. Then you're throwing this form away, you're printing the new one. Uh, the form is about 12 pages, I think. So if you made a mistake, 12 pages gone, because I know that well, from my experience working with the, a lot in my previous job and most of the people in office, they don't really tend to print that page that they're missing. Um, a couple of my colleagues, they used to do when they made a mistake, they just bin the entire document, all the pages and printing the new one. So it was waste of paper and extreme amount. Uh, once they made a mistake somewhere, they bin 25 pages and they printed 25 pages again because page whatever 12 had a mistake so I got this form I filled this form uh, I attached to the email as a reply to an email uh, and I sent it back to them and, they, and the insurance company phoned me next day and asked me how I filled this form because the form quality was exactly like they sent it to me but with my answers so I explained to them that I was using my Galaxy Tab S6 with a stylus and a Samsung app called Write on PDF to complete this form because I do understand why insurance company asked me because they probably thought that it's a fraud. I'd done something to this form that looks too suspicious. That the quality was too be good to be true to like it was super. It was the same document just with my writings. So that's why I decided to record this video just to demonstrate for you. So right enough story story about the moaning about the story etc. Right let's demonstrate for you. So obviously I'm not going to demonstrate how you download the attachments of your Gmail, Outlook, or whatever files. But what I'll do, I will try to demonstrate the actual app that you can basically edit these files. So this is my uh, Dex running off my Galaxy Tab S6. I'm gonna take the keyboard away. So keyboard goes away, and this is the Galaxy Tab S6. And if I go to Files and inside the internal storage under Download. I do have this form, which is called the 9971532. I think this is a case number or reference number for this insurance claim. But anyway, this is a file. So what I would like to do, I'd like to go right now and kill the DAX. So kill the DAX and you will see the, the actual screen of the app. And when I tapped on this PDF, I do have option right on PDF, Drive PDF, Eura and a bunch of other apps that I have installed to manipulate PDF files. I'm going to use right on PDF. So I'm going to tap on that and this opens up. Let's go to page one. <clears throat> so here you go. It's a Admiral Law Insurance Company. I already crossed it off the quite important information and I don't want to really share any public information, publicly all the information from this case. Uh, so it's just basically uh, information from this insurance company. Uh, page two is basically nothing. Uh, page three, nothing. Page four, that's where it starts the information showing up for, for, this, <clears throat> for this claim. And here we go. So I received, imagine, like I got this. 
and I said like it's not a problem for me to fill this in so I chose let's say a black color this pen and home number so that's it oh one two three four five six okay it's a bit too fat or too bold so let's delete that and let's choose a smaller smaller size so oh one two three four five six six seven eight mobile number five 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 oops press the side button for for press the side button on the pen so it activates this overlay thing five and work number will be nine nine one one two two three three and that's it and i carry on i and i continued um uh, filling this form time of accident uh, i remember like it happened yesterday it was 1745 where were at the time on planet earth that's where i was at the time of the accident <laughs> anyway so i fill in this form like this and without, obviously you can add the text so i clicked on the add the text and now i do have like a line constantly showing up uh that I, if I want to, I can um, add the text this way. So let's say I'm gonna reduce this here, and obviously I can start typing here and add in the text, and it's gonna be like a printout. But I thought I'm not gonna do this because it's gonna feel a bit uh, too much. So I decided to write everything down with the using hand with the pen. And as example, this. The question did you see the collision obviously this is a bad example but something like yes or no you have an answer so i'm gonna say uh yes i saw the and suddenly like you 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 marked the answer this way you literally just draw over word no and you marked yes as your answer but then you suddenly realize you picked the right wrong answer what you would do in that case you would do you will print the page four you will print the page four again just because of this mistake but because all this is so amazingly easy to correct and you're gonna say you can obviously choose choose this way and something you notice on the form is incorrect let's say for example um, your date of birth or your name was incorrect and you can say oh no no this is this is wrong wrong and actual date of birth is this and it's not only working like th this kind of uh, application this app can be used in any pdf file let's say you're a teacher and you're receiving the your pupils um your your like uh, exam results you're receiving from your from your from your class and you need to correct them or something you're going to print them all no you just grab the pen uh stylus and the galaxy tab s6 and the dex you using your, you're using dex for your file management or whatever and then obviously using this to do all these changes and that what you need and when are you done and just click save the top right corner click save save the file go back to dex and inside dex i'm just going to use as example the uh, gmail to send this file back to the in my case was the insurance company the samsung app right on pdf is free available inside a google play store and a galaxy store when you install this app, you will not find it from the uh, from the launch. So if I go to the app draw, I mean, if you go to app draw, you're not gonna find this app here because it's only available when you're actually trying to open the PDF file. And when you open the PDF file, that's when you will find this app working. And um, that's it. Pretty much easy peasy to use app. Thank you much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comment section below what you think, what else, what, what else you want me to try. Do you have any other amazing apps? Because I'm looking on Google Play Store and lately I can't find anything useful for Dex. I mean, I feel like I tried pretty much everything. Anyway, if you have any suggestions, leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget we are on the Reddit, Samsung Dex subreddit group. All the links you need to for these all social media you'll find the description below go and use this app and save trees by the way because you don't need to print anything because you have everything digitalized and just all you need is a stylus obviously if you have a note 9 or note 10 even the, the same you grab your phone and you fill the form obviously slightly smaller screen that screen smaller screen than my tab 6
Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next one. Goodbye.